what's going on everybody? My name is John Hammond, more Pico CTF 2019. This challenge is called Mr. Worldwide for 200 points in the cryptography section. It has a low number of solves, 2,965, I guess low for some of the others that we've seen. So it's interesting and frustrating and odd, and I think some people had some questions with it. So it says, a musician left us a message. What does it mean? Let's go ahead and W get that and start to work with it. So I will make a directory for Mr. Worldwide. And we'll hop over there and we will download this file. So we have message.txt. If we take a look at it, it has some interesting information, right? There's Pico CTF in our curly braces. And then we have parentheses with some values in them, but they're all like, with a decimal representation that goes kind of far out with its precision. Some of these are negative. So I think what you could do is maybe assume that these are GPS coordinates, and that is the correct route to go down. So it's kind of, I guess, annoying in, in that sense. But let's go ahead and kind of remove some of these new lines or these parentheses that we could end up using for new lines here. And let's also remove the opening slash. So now we have each of these on a new line. I don't think I really wanted that. Let's just replace that with nothing. With, there now. Okay. So we could go ahead and copy and paste this into like Google Maps or something and maybe slowly carve out where these particularly are. Google Maps, thank you. And let's start to throw in these coordinates, latitude and longitude coordinates, and see where this brings us. So, okay, there is no flag or anything noted particularly at this street corner here. Um, the correct direction to go with this is to actually collect the name of the city for each of these, and then that will slowly build out what would be the flag. So if we actually end up taking each of these, you could one by one slowly capture and write out Dayton, Ohio as a city here. Grab the next one, grab the next one, and one by one, you might be able to grab each of these. This is Istanbul. This could take some time, right? And doing this manually is kind of annoying, but that will end up tracking down the flag for you if you take the first letter of each of these cities. Um, eventually, you should find that the flag is Pico CTF Kodiak underscore Alaska. And you can see that our underscore remains in there from where we started earlier. So let's grab that. And they wanted it all. Did they want it in caps? Let's go find out. No, nope, there's no hints on that. And it looks like it's just a regular flag format. That was the solution, tracking down each of these, finding the city, and slowly building out K, and then O, and then D, and then I, and then A, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Um, eventually, you'd build out. Kodiak underscore Alaska, and that is what they were looking for. So interesting challenge. Maybe if you see these, uh, if it's any kind of puzzle that you happen to be working with, view those as GPS coordinates, latitude and longitude, and you could track down some information. In this case, it was the first letter of the city for each of these coordinates. So that's that. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this one. Super simple, super easy, but it's just a matter of kind of figuring out and tracking down really what that was looking for and slowly you could build out some information. But Kodiak maybe not be the best word to start with to really get the player thinking that they're on the right track. Who knows? So, love to see you guys in the next video. Love to see you on Discord. Love to see you on Patreon, PayPal, all the other things. Thank you guys for watching. Let's go ahead and save this as a flag.txt, and we can mark that challenge as complete and move on for the next video. With the, with the